and as you see the breakdown has to eventually happen it the position is in profits take a look at this breakout guys everything is super simple that's why our position and up in profits and yep all the position and up in profit there we go this is the perfect outcome i was telling you about Greetings fellow traders, my name is Ted Trader and I'm here to guide you through the world of binary options trading. I'll be sharing the most effective and profitable strategies to help you succeed. If you're new to this scene and lack experience, join to my closer telegram groups where I provide a free signals with a 90% accuracy rate. Social trading is also an option perfect for those who have limited time and can't constantly monitor their trades. Simply copy my moves and make profitable deals without needing to be at your computer or phone. Don't forget watch video in full, hit the subscribe button, like and leave a comment. By doing so, you'll be automatically interned into $300 Joe, where 3 lucky subscribers will each win $100 from me. Let's begin our journey together and make some profits. So guys, let's start our trading session. Today all the currency pair are EOTC. Let's have a trading weekend. We're gonna open position for the maximum deposit amount as usual. We got $27 on the balance. We trade on a one minute time frame, guys. Uh, I'll show you today indicators. The first one is the Bollinger Bands, and the second one is the Stochastic Escalator. Uh, what concerns the settings? Set the period 13 on the Bollinger Bands and the deviation to 2. Save the changes and let's make the stochastic a bit less price sensitive. Set the period to 20. The overbought zone is gonna be 70. The oversold zone is gonna be 30. Uh, there we go. We will use these settings today and let's begin our trading session and find most promising trade and trade. Um, So let's analyze the market. Well, we're gonna find uh, out what's going on here. We got OTC today, and it means that we're gonna have the maximum payout rate. And let's take a look. Uh, we're continuing on the stochastic. So here, I guess we should open a short position. I'll point uh, out the workspace and. Uh, explain the trade entry uh, look the downtrend is dominated on the stochastic this is the peak and we expect in the reversal uh, the touch of the overbought zone here we also see the touch of the upper boundary of the channel a look at this long week uh, it could be a potential signal of the trend reversal uh, but in this case, after this correction, it indicates a continuation of the downtrend. That's why we opened the short position. Uh, as you can see, the price started going down exactly as uh, we expected. The candle is, has a long week. It tells us the downward dynamics is expected. There are reversal seconds uh, left before the closing and the first position has been closed in a profit, guys. Let's update the trade amount and find the car next currency pair. Let's continue analyzing. We're looking for the most promising trade entry. Uh, look at this downward volatility and basically we're gonna play out ahead of the market. Let's open a long position. There we go. Uh, considering the price dynamics and its volatility, the movement go goes uh, down on the stochastic, but we don't look at that. Uh, it's uh, more important to point out the support zone here. The touching is happening, and I believe that we are gonna see the correction. 
The long candle was formed here, that's why we opened the long. Uh, there are also the touch of the lower boundary of the channel. We're playing ahead of the market. The breakout is a minimum here. And there it is, uh, the breakout has eventually happened, guys. The price is heading upwards, there are around 15 seconds left before the closing. The support zone played out perfectly, the local low was updated and the price started going up. As simple as that. And our position has been closed with a profit, guys. Uh, so let's update the trade amount and carry on the trading session. We are looking for the most promising currency pairs. So here uh, we have to play out the continuation of the trend. Uh, there are uh, the downward dynamics on the chart. We see the touch of the upper boundary of the channel. We also that the moving averages on the stochastic are the are the top around the level 90. Uh, uh, and we release uh, that the reversal is about to happen. And we open the short right after the correction. I think this is a very good trade entry. And yep, uh, the price has gone down. There was nothing complicated. We relied on three signals. Uh, first, we monitored the correction. Then we watched the stochastic and finally the touch of the upper boundary. So all their signals flash it and we open the position. As simple as that. There are several seconds left out left in our position is in profit again guys let's not drag this out and carry on the trading session find the next currency pair <sighs> so we're gonna find the most profitable trade entry and i i already see a good trade entry so uh, let's open the short here i'll uh, point out the workspace we have a strong downward dynamics on the chart. The stochastic is at the bottom. Also, there are a low volatility movement. Small pullbacks takes place. Uh, but uh, in case the candle went too high, we're playing ahead of the market. After which the price should go lower. The update is low. Uh, we're expecting to see the breakdown in the end. Uh, like I said, we played ahead of the market, and I think opening a short in the best possible auction here. There are around 10 seconds left before closing. We're waiting for the breakdown and we will be in profit. And as you see, the breakdown has eventually happened. The position is in profits exactly as I predicted and uh, there is no stopping here let's carry on the trading session change the currency pair so let's continue analyzing and see what do we got here uh, look at this long week and we instantly open along here we see that the stochastic uh, is facing upwards uh, yep uh, there is uh, the downward dynamics, but the principle of trade entry is a bit different here. We see the dump here, uh, but we see a lot of pullbacks and correction in the past. And basically, uh, we're playing uh, ahead of the market. Mm, uh, we see the touch of the support, mm, after which uh, the price should go up. Uh, we are definitely going to see some upward dynamics and the breakout is expected in the end. And the position should be in profit. Let's watch. There are around 15 seconds uh, before the closing. Potentially we could have seen a small reversal here because there are a lot of correction and pullbacks on the charts. Anyway, our position has closed in profits. Let's update the trade amount and continue the trading session. Uh, we are going to find the next currency pair. Uh, this is our signal. 
let's open a short position right away actually we got two signals here um, uh, first of all we see the touch of the upper boundary of the channel then we see that the stochastic crosses the overbought zone this is number two uh, and in, and in general there, there is uh, the downtrend on the chart and this upward dynamics is a contemporary correction actually we have one more signal here this is the third one and now the pullback is over and we're gonna see some downward dynamics here and that's exactly what's happening now the breakdown has eventually happened and this massive week tell us the downtrend should be continued the stochastic cross it uh, the zone 70 and we already see the massive breakdown basically the correction was over at this level and there we go another position in profit let's update the trade amount and carry on the trading session let's refresh the page and take a look what do we got here <sighs> very promising pump that's why we should open a short position guys we already traded the currency pair and if we uh, happen to open more position on this one they'll be short ones mm, uh, well our sell signal basically we see a strong downward dynamics and the main signal uh, here is the pullback and this touch of the lower boundary of the channel um, basically it's ordinary things for this kind of movements um, the pullback has to be over that why you opening a short in the best possible option here and that's exactly what we did and yep the breakdown is gaining momentum there was nothing complicated here we just analyzed the movement in general and we understand uh, that this is clear down there. And another position has been closed in profits, guys. As simple as that. And let's find the next currency pair. And carry on the trading session. <clears throat> this is a touch here. Let's open the short. Uh, the price should go lower. We see this long shadow which uh, contributed to the opening. Uh, there is the downward trend on the chart. Here we see the pullback, but it should be over by now considering the shadow. That's why we open the short. Uh, the price dynamics is more downward and it should uh, should go lower and yep this is exactly what is happening that's why we open it at the short position uh, take a look at the first long week candle and here is the second one it indicates the continuation of the trend and this was the main signal uh, that's why our position has been closed in profit guys there is no stopping here let's find the next currency pair uh, let's carry on analyzing take a look at here it's time to open four long position we're playing ahead of the market i'll point out the workspace uh, quite good entry the main signal is a touch of the massive support zone Here's the first rebound, here's the second one, and the same this is expected here. Because uh, there was uh, the first touch, the second one, and the, here's the third touch. The double bottom pattern has been formed here, and if you look, the stochastic, the moving averages don't cross this level from bottom to top. It has already crossed it to oversold zone, and we're playing ahead of the market. We're expecting the breakout here. Uh, and the correction has already happened here and this correction is typical for this kind of movement that's why we're opening the long and yep take a look at this breakout guys everything is super simple that's why our position and up in profits and uh, uh, 
let's open our final position is order to consolidate uh, the profits and let's change the currency pair mm, uh, let's continue analyzing um, uh, what's here uh, we open a short without hesitation uh, very good trade entry guys I'll point out the workspace uh, like in the previous trade we released that the stochastic has already crossed the overbought zone and we're playing ahead of the market we see a good downward dynamics here and this is the first signal uh, here we see a good pullback from this zone this is the second signal here's the touch of the upper boundary of the channel and this is the third signal uh, and we observe the long week candle uh, which indicates the continuation of the downtrend and this is another signal that's why we open the short position and we can already see a small breakdown uh, there are around 10 seconds left before the closing the price is holding at this level now I'm fine with that there are several seconds left before the closing and yet our position have been closed in profits actually some of them ended up with zero and it's okay no big deal let's continue our trading session there uh, let's open nine thousand dollars position in order to reach the profit outcome so let's uh, refresh the page uh, there we go and let's carry on the trading session and find the next currency pair uh, what do we got here uh, here we go another good trade entry look at this massive correction i'm expecting it to uh, go a bit lower well there we go let's open a long position guys uh, we play ahead of the market guys and I'm expecting to see the breakout in the end on the last seconds and uh, we're gonna be in profits uh, the upward dynamics was strong it was too strong here and take a look at the touch of this price corridor uh, we got um, two signals here uh, this correction and the touch of the lower boundary of the channel Theoretically, we release that a good price dynamics takes place here and we open a long, playing ahead of the market. Uh, there are around 15 seconds left before the closing, a good position entry. We already see a good breakout and basically, I think this position should be closed in profits. There are several seconds left. And yeah. All the positions end up in profit there we go this is the perfect outcome i was telling you about one a minute one one minute time frame this is really important to keep track of time because um, uh, our position was just closed in profits uh, we made uh, some good profit and the price started going down guys and we all we open it a bit later it'd be a disaster but uh, we managed to get the right timing and we make a huge profit guys let's get down to withdrawal we better withdraw uh, 17,500 press the continue button there we go our transaction is being processed. I'll touch the screen where it's done. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you learned something uh, useful from the video. So it should be clear for you that it's possible to make some good money easily. There is nothing complicated about it. Thanks for watching. Press the like button. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Leave the comment down below. See you soon traders. Bye bye.